Plug and Mami Bao along with the boy Rai. And now we're gonna cook something that people seem to really love. It's called Masala Chicken. Yeah! Okay, for the ingredients, guys, we need garam masala, whipping cream, lemon, coriander, and cumin powder. I mix them together. And we need and we also need tomato puree, cilantro, jalapeno peppers, butter, dried kasuri and chicken. Okay, so ngayon, let's start cooking. Yes! So first let's put the batter. Oh I'll add the butter. Okay, sorry. Next time you let the let the butter melt. Guys, guys, hi, this is Daddy Regan behind the camera here. Now this, Val cooked this for me and Val, tell him the story about the first time I tried this chicken. Okay, yeah, we were so dating back then. And uh, actually, I gotta tell you something about this dish. I learned this dish from my roommate. He's an East Indian guy. And the first time we tried it, we were like, uh, I don't think I'm gonna like it. Because I think that was the first time I tried Indian food. I never tried Indian food till I came to Canada. So he cooked this for us, like with my other roommates, my friends. And we were like so hooked into it. So brang sarap niya. You know, compared to, to with that, um, butter chicken, I prefer this dish better. Hindi siya nakakasap, although may creamy siya, pero masarap. Hindi siya masyadong nakakasap. Now let's put the cumin ah. seed pan. So, your handbone. So, luto in lang natin. Luto in lang natin yung cumin. So, when we were still dating, after learning this dish, I cooked this and served it to Regan. I cooked like I used whole chicken, chopped it into pieces, and then I cook it. And guess what? He finished the whole thing. Like I probably have like maybe two cut of chicken and we can eat the rest. Like he finished it in one meal, like everything. <laughs> okay, now let's put the chicken. Hi guys, Daddy Regan behind the camera here. That I have to admit that is a true story. Like Valerie, I hadn't really eaten a lot of Indian food and man, I, I gotta tell you guys something. It really opens your eyes to the amazing flavors. Oh, yeah. There is some delicious Indian food. Any of our Indian viewers, obviously you know what we're talking about. It's a whole new world of flavor. I was so impressed with chicken masala. Like Valerie said, I think it's so much more tasty than butter chicken, personally. Yep, I agree. Indian food is spicy, but I love it. Try lang natin Guys, just a keynote, I marinated the chicken in a teaspoon of ginger paste, a teaspoon of garlic paste, salt, and if you want it spicy, you can add uh, chili powder as well. I prefer it a little spicy. It's better that way for me. So, let's cover the chicken muna para malito. Okay? Let this sit for 15 minutes. After flipping it, for the other side of the cook. So we'll make sure na luto yung chicken before we put the tomato paste. Kasi minsan, pag hindi pa luto yung chicken and then you put the acid, which is tomato, nagiging rubbery yung chicken. So we want it tender, right? Guys, for, for those of you who've tried maybe like a Thai curry, uh, a curry in Japan or even a Filipino curry mm -hmm. this is the original this yeah. is the curry of all curries and it's spicy it's rich and it's delicious unlike a Thai curry it doesn't so have Thai coconut curry, milk yeah. Thai curry and Filipino curry are coconut milk based and honestly guys I really have to tell you I I really prefer the Indian curry And I know Val definitely isn't the biggest fan of the coconut milk herself. It's too rich. 
Like, my own mind. Valerie, what's that Indian dish that Brian really loves that you make? Oh, he likes the chickpea one. It's called chana masala. Yeah, chana masala it is good actually. Yes. I don't know how to cook it, but I think I tried cooking it before and it was a failure. It's an epic fail. <laughs> I think two dishes Val had trouble with is chana masala and biryani is also a little bit difficult to cook without the proper pot. Biryani maybe. I'm not sure about chana masala. Maybe yes, yes. Coriander and cumin powder. Ryan, right? that's gonna be for later. Okay. What's cumin powder? What's cumin powder? Mm -hmm. It's a spice. It's a delicious spice. Mm -hmm. And cumin is also very healthy. Yeah, I really like the flavor. Guys, another dish that Belle cooks is the bakra curry, and I love that one. Bakra is goat, but you can also use lamb. So, like, a lot of Western people aren't comfortable eating goat, but it's actually really, really delicious. Well, I never had goat till I came here, too. So. But there's this th dish called kalderetang uh, kambing. Kambing is a goat. So, I never tried that, too. <laughs> and Val, would you say kind of like goat? It's kind of like lamb meat, but less greasy, less fat, right? Um, yeah, I think goat has less, uh, uh, it has less aftertaste. Lamb has some, you may aftertaste na kahit lutoin mo na. Fragrant, it's very fragrant meats. No, there's so much. Kahit ang dami mo nang nilagay na spices, talagang umaangat yung taste. Parang fat siguro. Mm, yes, there's a lot of fat. That's for sure. So yeah, go, goat is a... Give it a shot, guys. It's actually a really good meat. Now, we're gonna put the tomato. So with this tomato puree, ang gamit ko dito is Roma tomato. Siguro mga four to five pieces. So, idun lang ka lang. So that's gonna be the gravy. What? Actually, just the gravy of the hun. Ulam na. <laughs> Even without chicken, the gravy is so good. Yes, guys, make sure you make enough gravy because it is delicious. Yeah, yeah even these. You put it on, it's like Valerie Ooh. says, it's definitely oolong. You want to put this on top of rice. Delicious. Yeah, yeah delicious. Oh, Lutuin lang natin yung tomato. Okay, so it's boiling na, guys. Let's open it. Mmm, it's boiling. Lutuin lang natin ng kaunti. Where are we gonna add next? Yes, we'll add the jalapeno. Pino next. Can you hand me the jalapeno next? Here you go, Mom. Thank you. Yay! Okay, to those who's asking for the recipe of this dish, there you go, guys. Guys, we'll definitely put it, uh, the ingredients and the directions yeah. in the notes of this video. Make sure to like and comment. It's thick, it's zesty, and it's definitely must wrap. Okay, shout out to Ate Jackie. <laughs> Ate Jackie, ito na ang recipe. Oh, and to Ella as well. <laughs> <laughs> you people, ito na ang recipe. <laughs>
Look at the rich colors, guys. Look at look at the rich colors. It's so creamy now. Friend, would you like to try this? Let's see how spicy. Masara. Mmm, like it, eh? Hi guys, this is the finished product. And generally, we serve this with rice. Yeah. Yeah? Right. Okay, so that's it for today. So if you like this video, please give us a thumbs up. Leave a comment to let us know that you like this. Um, make sure you subscribe and ring the bell.